Hello, this is Dr. Samir Dari Savifard with USMD Urology in Dallas, Fort Worth. I'm a fellowship trained female urologist and I'm here today to talk to you about urinary tract fistulas. What is a fistula? Well, a fistula is a communication between two hollow parts of your body. Most commonly in women, it involves a communication between the bladder and the vagina. Are there other types of fistulas? Of course. Fistulas can involve any hollow organ in the body. Uh, they can involve the bowels, they can go to the skin, or other parts of the urinary or reproductive tract. Most commonly, the fistulas are diagnosed because of some type of incontinence issue that is continuous and the patient doesn't recognize what's going on. In general, most fistulas in the United States occur from a post-surgical complication of some sort. In women, generally this involves having had a hysterectomy, in which case the bladder may be affected or injured, and it heals in such a way that a fistula does develop. What happens to a fistula if it is not treated? Well, in general, what happens is the tract matures, and by that I mean that essentially the communication or the tract that forms between these body parts can form a lining and it doesn't go away on its own. In general, this is some type of treatment that requires some type of surgical procedure to excise or remove the whole fistula tract and repair the defect in a number of layers to make sure that it doesn't come back again in the future.